We're using a remote trigger with a short travel, so I need to be 100 metres away from the explosion in that. Yeah, I know, but it does mean I'll get to experience very much at first hand the impact of 20 separate explosions detonating within half a second of one another to try and shift 20,000 tonnes of rocks. So in that sense, I'm lucky to be in there. Nice. Oh, yeah. I feel safe. So I arm it with that. And it is now armed. Counting down from five, four, three, two, one. Twenty thousand tons of rock gone in a second, and I'm still safe, which is a bonus. That was quite a rumble. I really felt that. Yeah, just to actually feel the earth move because of something that you've just triggered. That's quite a sensation. Yeah, a little lie down is needed. But it's only when we slow down the film 40 times that we can see more of what just happened and why I wasn't turned into mush. There's a flash as the detonation came and ignites. And now we can see the blast go off, one every 25 milliseconds. is not the blast. It's the shock waves that each blast releases. Deep in the quarry face, the shock waves are forcing their way through sheer rock, eventually erupting at the top. choreographing the explosions, we were able to drive and steer the shockwaves through the rock rather than let them spill out into the air around, which is why I was able to get so close. Not sure I'd want to get much closer. <laughs> 